Today we will discuss how to get Sketchfab models into Flux Game Engine. I guess you have Flux Engine installed and know the basics of Flux Game Engine. To download a 3D model, we will be going on Sketchfab. Sketchfab is my number one option if I am trying to find a 3D model. Getting a model into Flux requires some kinds of things. Let's do this thing first. First of all, Google out S K E T C H F B, which is Sketchfab, and it will take you to here. If it doesn't come, scroll down and find it out, and you will see this Sketchfab.com, and click on Sketchfab. We will need to decide what kind of model we will be getting inside of Flex Engine. Let's search card. I should also point out that if you are using the licenses of NC or non-commercial you cannot make a commercial game I mean you are not allowed to make a commercial game if you are using an NC model so filter them out and select the things that don't have the NC or non-commercial license so that you can make you can use them in your commercial projects without of having any copyright strikes on your game select out these four things I have selected the standard is also possible to download but let's not get it inside and this is all and after that make sure you, are, you have clicked on downloadable and right here you will now find lots of 3d models to use in your commercial game let's get something inside the flux engine let's get this thing and another thing is if it doesn't has the FBX or OBJ support, you cannot use in Flux Engine. If it is not OBJ or FBX. To determine that, as I have opened this car and on this car, there is something called download 3D model. If it doesn't appear, it means it is not downloadable. But if it appears, it is downloadable. So it appears, so it is downloadable. Let's see what we have got here. And you will also have to be logged into download things from Sketchfab. As there is no FBX or OBJ, we cannot use it in Flux Game Engine for Flux Engine. You can download this for Unity or other engines, but not for Flux Engine yet. For Flux Engine, again, you will need OBJ and FBX out. And let's go back find another card that has the FBX. This model too. Let's check this one. Goblin. No, no, no. But, but, and, Oh, okay, okay. This one has FBX, or here you can see this is FBX. So downloading this would be usable in Flux Engine. So, so now let's download the FBX file. Let's go to the folder where it is downloaded. On here, this is the thing that I have downloaded, which is the car model. First of all, you can see it is formatted. I mean, compressed by zip. So here. You right click on it and click on extract all which will extract all the things inside of that folder now inside of the newly created folder from the zip file there is the fbx file and don't forget about the textures the way sketchfab structures its files is not okay for flux engine let's give some sense on it cut these textures and paste it on source and on the source uh, let's name it and remember the 3d model should be in fbx or obj format or you cannot use it in flux game engine here you can see this is actually fbx so it is confirmed that it is fbx so we can get it inside of the flux engine now to get this thing inside flux engine there are two ways to get it inside of flux engine project well here you can see the F F in the project on here let's create something called a, a folder which will be named as models usually i follow this structure inside of models i keep my all the model files now go to the file manager get to that thing fbx thing fbx formats folder click drag it drag and drop the car model in the models folder drop it in this blank space if you need LODs to be automatically generated for this model, you can click on this model called Generate LOD. But I will not do this for this purpose. Click Import. And also import the textures too. So that we have 
imported it it won't be seen in here right now and let's get a new scene we will name it showcase right click on the contents folder go to get to new and on here find scene on here you can see this this scene and get this scene and i will name it the showcase scene double click to open it and on here we will drag and drop the car model to drag and drop the car model let's first get a model called Hector right click on the scene get to new and click on model on this model we will need to assign that thing that car thing we just download it and like which is just like this and you can see it is currently not in perfect orientation to get it in the correct orientation we will actually have to rotate it for 180 degrees in x axis and you can see on here our 3d model there are some things you will need to still do what are those those are the texturing the color of the 3d model and you will have to remove this plane which is not for the on for this tutorial and yeah that's how you can bring a model inside of flux engine more tutorials are upcoming i usually would upload on this channel about unity flex and blender stay tuned and we will be meeting on the next video